Hello guys, thanks for coming out here today. We really do appreciate you, my people. Thank you once again for your continuous, massive and huge support to this channel. You guys are simply the best. And we pray that even as you are supporting this channel, God Almighty will support you in whatsoever you lay your hands to do. In Jesus' name, amen. Yes, my people, the news we've gotten before our decks today is from APC. Just um, yesterday, Ali Mahmoud Sharif, the former governor to Bornu State, stormed APC Secretariat as the plot to install a northern man as chairman thickens. We all know that um, it's been said that um, even the suspension of our Shomale and his uh, the dissolution of the National Working Committee is all a plot together to, to install um, a northern man in all of the positions. You can see that even when the National Working Committee was was dissolved immediately a caretaker committee was set up by president Mohammed buhari and the neck and the next thing we got was that it was a northern and who was placed to head that committee right now we don't know um, what um, ali mahmoud and um, sharif is all about as he stumps the apc national secretariat we'll get more details in a moment guys but before we do please if you haven't given us a thumbs up do give us a thumbs up, hit on the like button. We really do appreciate you. And please don't forget to subscribe as well. Hit on the subscribe button, my people. It does mean a lot to us. Thank you once again. Yes, let's just get straight into the news and get all of the details. Ali Modu Sheriff storms APC Secretariat as plot to install Northern as Chairman Thickens. Former Borno State Governor Ali Maudu Sheriff was spotted on Thursday at the National Secretariat of the All Progressive Congress APC in Abuja. Sheriff, who came in unannounced at about 4.15 p.m., refused to disclose the reason for his visit and left at about 4.30 p.m., having met with one of the members of the Mai Mala Burning Lead Ketika Extraordinary National Conventional Planner Committee. The former Bornu governor was a founding member of the APC, but had ditched the party for the People's Democratic Party, PDP, and went on to emerge as its acting national chairman before his eventual ouster by the court and consequent return to the APC. While a chieftain of the party, Ambassador Dagogo Fumbara, who is positioning himself to become the national youth leader of the party, said it would be in great to have a northern APC chairman to make power shift easier in 2023. This will put paid to speculations that the North is keen on holding on to the presidency. If the North produces the national chairman of the party, who will most likely be there for four years, it will mean the South will nationally produce our presidential candidate, which is good for the party, he said. There are speculations that the party is seeking to produce a Northern and as chairman in its upcoming national convention ahead of the 2023 general elections. It will be recalled that the party was embroiled in several crises last month after its national chairman, Adam Soshomole, was suspended by a court of appeal in Abuja. This broke the party into factions before a national executive council meeting was organized in Aso Rock and chaired by President Mohamed Buhari. The party resolved at a meeting to dissolve its national working committee in order to establish peace and internal party discipline. A caretaker committee led by Yobe State Governor Mai Mala Burni was set up in order to strengthen reconciliation and organize a convention where new members of the National Working Committee will be elected. Wow, so guys, and we see this, all of this is just a plot because from dissolving the National Working Committee, it's quite understandable here yeah, that um, Adam Soshomale was suspended, but dissolving the National Working Committee, it's all a plot. And we can see that all of this plot is all gearing towards the 2023 um, race in order to set up, to bring up um, another Northern man as the chairman of the All Progressive Congress, the national chairman. And we know, guys, um, that um, if um, we get uh, another man as um, the, cha the, the national chairman of APC, 
that that person is going to be there for another four years. And we know four years from now um, spans into um, 2023 when the presidential election is going to be due. So are we going to call all of this a plot? Because look at this uh, um, former Bernou State Governor Ali uh, uh, Mahmoud um, Sheriff who stormed the APC Secretariat um, just um, yesterday. And we can see this guy's move. He used to be um, in PDP before. Um, move back to APC. So he's just been moving, but um, it's, it looks like all of this is circling around the north because immediately the, the um, National Working Committee was dissolved. What President Mohammed did was that um, he set up a new committee and he called that committee the caretaker committee and that um, they were going to plan the APC convention, which they've not had, uh, which was due, past due, I'll say that word. So um, his duty is to instill peace into the party and also organize the national um, the national convention and in that national convention that is upcoming sometime and um, before the end of this year it's been said that a new uh, national working committee members will be elected and as such there will be need for a new national chairman who is this likely gonna be what are the north up to this time around what are they planning we can see that right now it's been said that even as a bola tinubu his position uh is 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 on the edge right now you know so many um things has been said about him um, as a waju and so many lashes and then um, he's come out to defend himself to actually state that um he's not uh he's not upset with buhari's um, decision but we know very well that these two people adam soshomale and uh, the person of Asewaju Bola Tinubu, it looks like they've been used and they've been dumped. They've been sidelined as well. It looks like they're not even in the middle of things. Remember in the initial stage, when this APC crisis started, all the APC governors, they went to Asewaju Bola Tinubu. They were all just rallying around him and seeking um, his opinion on how, on how this crisis would be resolved. At that stage, he did not do much. But right now, that Adam Soshomola is no more there. It was even only at that point when um, the court upheld the suspension of Adam Soshomole that um, Asewaju Bola Tinubu actually spoke up and said something. The next time he had to say something was when um, the, the news was going around that um, he's not happy with um, what Buhari has done, that he has been sidelined. Uh, he came out with a statement uh, that um, himself and Buhari, they still have a good relationship. Nothing is wrong. He accepts Buhari's decision of dissolving the National Working Committee. But we know how all of this affects his um, presidential ambition, the 2023 presidential ambition. No wonder he came up, guys. You know what he said? He stated that, uh, you know, in politics, politics is uncertain, that uh, you never can tell what will happen. So he really didn't give um, um, much. He did not um, really uh, categorically say that um, he was going to be running for 2023. But what he did leave Nigerians with was that politics is uncertain so invariably he's telling you that um, come 2023 if you see him um on the on the billboard running um for the for the race then know that um he has for wonders he has pre wonders that um um politics is uncertain so yes, guys, with all of that um, in the background, all of that going on, uh, with Adam Soshomale also stating that he has accepted the decision and all of that, what is presidency really after? Who are they trying to impose as the new national chairman? Because we know very soon the National Convention of the All Progressive Congress is going to hold a new uh, um, national working committee because um, when he set up the, the My Bernie um, Ketika um, Committee, he stated that it was just an interim one that is due to last about six months. So when that time expires, definitely um, a new National Working Committee will be set up and it will need a national chairman. Who is that person going to be? What are they plotting? They are just trying to strategize themselves to see that um, in every in every place um, they have all the northerners in place in key positions to do whatever they are set to do in 2023 but anyways nigerians our eyes are open we're watching them and we're seeing we're going to see how all of this um, plays out so guys please leave your take and let's know what you think about all of this and the news we're bringing is that um, ali mahmoud sharif um stormed the apc secretariat in abuja just yesterday and um he did not disclose to the public he did not disclose to newsmen what his intentions were at the secretariat but we all know that this is a plot to install um another and as a as the national chairman once again so guys let us know what you think about all of this I want to say a big thank you guys and um, to everyone thank you very much we appreciate you please if you haven't given us a thumbs up do give us a thumbs up hit on the like button and don't forget to subscribe till i come your way again it's bye for now and god bless